Okay, so we're going to do Virgo. This could be you who went through this. This could be someone that you're attached to, someone that you have detached from. It could be someone who wants to come towards you, different people that they're attached to, different people that they have detached from. This is masculine and feminine energy, past, present, or near future. So you have to take what resonates and leave what doesn't. What do we have for Virgo? Distant horizons. This could be someone that you distance yourself from or um, this person feel distant from you. You could be moving away or you moved away from this person. This person could live at a distance. Yeah, family room is here. This could be a family member. This could be somebody in your family that feel like, you know, you're moving forward. You've moved on. It could be looking at you as someone that moved forward in life. Bad health is here. Thief is here. And then community. So, so whoever this person is, they could literally be in bad health. And this could be a family member. You have the community in the reverse. The thief wanted to pop out in the reverse, but it, you know, it's in the upright. And it's like somebody could have wanted a community of people to think that you were someone that was um, not who you were. And that didn't work. Poverty is here. And then despair. Wow. Somebody is definitely feeling stuck. Imprisonment is here. You have despair. You have poverty. So somebody could feel like they're trapped in poverty. They're going through some type of financial hardship. This person could have lost their job. Yeah, and it's like that person see you moving forward or they see that you have moved forward and they feel stuck. They could have ran around the community and, you know, try to make it seem like you were in bad health. This is something serious. Courthouse is here. Yeah, you could have been, you know, in some type of court situation and, um, it was some type of deception involved for you to be in this situation. This person ran around the community. They were talking about you in a negative way. They could have wanted people to think that you were sick. Yeah, so this person could have talked about you in front of a lot of people. You know, they wanted these people to think that you were someone that was in bad health. You were sick. And um, you were wrapped up in some type of situation um, where it was deception involved. Now this person feels left out in the cold. They see that you have moved forward in life. Pathway is here. You went towards a whole other direction. Your pathway is clear and they feel stuck. Yeah, if this person was putting their mouth on you, it's like they're in despair. Because they could not hold. Yeah, it's like you're moving forward towards commitment. You could be getting ready to get in a relationship. Building a stable foundation with someone. Yeah, then journey is here. Somebody is coming towards you that wants to work with you. You have journey, toil and labor, and then you have courtship. So you're getting ready to get in a relationship. And this person had to went, you know, to a community of people. These could have been people that knew you or people that didn't know you. And they were talking about you in a negative way. And this could have literally been a family member that you're not even attached to or you just distance yourself from that person. This person could have been someone that's low vibrational. Now they're being seen in this energy and they're in despair. This person feels trapped. 
they feel stuck. Oh, so done. Yeah, because you're someone that's having victory and success. High honor is here. A lot of people respect you. They look up to you. You're being held in high honor. Wow. This could have been somebody that thought they were going to, you know, talk about you in a negative way and they would get away with it. You would never know. You at least suspect how God works. Now this person is sitting in despair. Yeah, you're an official. You're being seen as an official person. You're having victory. Yeah, and this person is concerned because they had to ran around her putting their mouth on you. Message of concern. You're someone that's very gifted. You're someone that's very abundant. It's just like God keep on blessing you with an overflow of abundance. And this person is in despair. You have to be mindful of who you put your mouth on in a negative way. God is going to have that person in this eight of swords energy while, you know, they're watching you have your abundance. This person did not know this. They were too busy putting their mouth on you, trying to make you look bad and make their self look good in front of a community of people that possibly don't even know this. <laughs> oh, so that this is the reason they got karma work. You need to fact, you know, how God will come through. And prepare a table for you. In the presence of enemies that you don't even know. Even if this was a family member, you didn't know this person was your enemy. <laughs> Five of ones, this person is secretly in competition with you. I you didn't even know this, whoever this person is. I'm so done. Eight of cups is here, six of wands is here, and four of wands is here. It's like you walked away from toxic people, toxic patterns, a confused mindset. Now you're at the six of wands have a victory and success. You have a stable foundation. This could be a business with this four of wands being here. <laughs> so, yeah, you you could be on a platform or you could have a business online or something. Queen of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. It's like you're prospering. And this person was secretly in competition. They thought they had a one-up Jew by putting their mouth on you. But no. This person was keeping their self stuck and they didn't know. Nine of Wands is here. This person is feeling guilty about whatever they did. Yeah. They're nervous about how these people are seen. Because they yet to turn out a brand and they did something way too quick. They did something without thinking. This is so serious. You at least think I got to come to. Yeah, they did something too quick. It's like you're in this nine of pinnacles energy. Someone that's very, you know, very stable. This person wanted to make it seem like you were mentally unstable, but you're in this nine of pinnacles energy. Physically, mentally, and spiritually stable. You're someone that is very successful. This entire time, this person is being seen as someone that was secretly in competition with you, jealous of you because of your stability. You were minding your business the entire time. You didn't even know this was going on because it happened at a distance. Now these people could be literally like watching you. They could see you attracting a lot of attention and that person is in despair. It's like they got caught and people are, you know, with the community popping out in reverse. They, these are people that are no longer like attached to this person or, you know, they don't want to be attached to that person. These are people that they cannot go and put their mouth on, you know, put their mouth on you too. This is so serious. <laughs> yeah, they got caught. The hangman is here. Wow. It's like this person made their self look bad. <laughs> wow. In front of a whole community of people. The emperor is here. Justice is here, and then the shrimp card is here. Yeah, you are definitely helping somebody get enlightened, whoever this emperor is. And um, you help this person gain some type of strength so they can bring in justice for their self. Ten of Wands is here. Wow. And it's like, if this person, if this emperor, this could be this person's father. If this person went to their father and talked about you in a negative way, that person is watching you. They see you as someone that's very strong. 
And it's like justice is coming in for you with this Ten of Wands. Somebody is burdened because justice is being served for you or something was balanced out because this person was hoping to, you know, keep talking about you in a negative way, but this have made you grow. People look at you as someone that's very strong. Somebody that went through a lot, but you still were able to come out on top. Yeah, whatever situation you went through, you know, you had strength. It pushed you to move forward. It didn't do nothing but help your growth. Four of Swords is here. And then the Moon card is here. It's like whatever this person was doing for a long time in secret, it was laid to rest. Wow. So somebody could have been in, it's like somebody could have ended something with them and they were trying to hide it. Like people like to project negative energy onto other people. So other people want, you know, so people want to ask what's going on in their situation. So they bring up a different topic. And you were the topic of this person's discussion. After the, somebody ended something out with them, they were trying to keep it hidden. You know, like why that person ended something out and it, something came to a complete end. I'm also getting you were in solitude for swords. People possibly did not know the real reason why you distanced yourself from this person or cut this person off. They were trying to hide that. Yeah, five of pentacles is here, three of swords, and then the lovers is here. Somebody that they were in a relationship with cut this person off. They left this person out in the cold. And they were trying to hide this. They didn't want other people to know why their relationship came to a complete end. So they figured that they would talk about you. Didn't know by putting their mouth on you. They were just, you know, helping you manifest, helping you prosper. Yeah, Page of Swords is here. And it's like they're just sitting back watching you. They could be watching you online, you know, trying to calculate and add up your business or something like that or your finances. This is sad. Yeah, they're not happy in their own life. Nine of Cups in the reverse. This person is not happy with their self. So they ran in quick, night of sore, start spreading rumors, gossip, lies, slander, talking about you, spreading stuff that wasn't even true. And this is how people are seeing them, jealousy. Because they're not happy in their own life. You're someone that loves yourself, Ace of Cups. This person could be someone that has to be attached to someone. In order to make their self feel good. They have to be in a relationship. They have to be attached to different people. But you're someone that loves yourself. You were in this four source energy. Isolated. But you were working on yourself. It's like you were focusing on your stability. You know, keeping yourself in this energy of um, being stable. Working hard. And this is why you're constantly being blessed with abundance. You weren't paying attention to any of this. You were in hermit mode. Hey, you didn't know this. These were lies that were told on you. Two of swords is here. You were blinded from the truth as you were in hermit mode. Focusing on your, you know, your destiny, your purpose, your calling. The will of fortune is here. But this person wanted other people to think that you were in bad health. They could have wanted these people to think that you were crazy. And it did not work. Yeah, this was deception. Seven of Swords is here. This person thought they had done did something and got away with it. And they released this fact. Yeah, Queen of Swords and then Queen of Wands is here. Yeah, this person could have gotten mad because you cut them off. You could have spoke the truth to this person, spoke the truth about this person. And they got mad because you distanced yourself from them. It could be, this person could be intimidated with how um, intelligent you are. 
The Queen of Swords is someone that is very intelligent and a high vibrational energy. Queen of Wands is here. You're someone that's very beautiful. You're someone that is very attractive. You're someone that has a lot of confidence. And um, you're a leader. This is why this person caused this deception. This is why this person was being sneaky and spreading lies on you. I'm so done. The death card is here. Yeah, you went through a total transformation. You ended something out, experienced a rebirth, and you walked into a whole nother cycle, started something new. While this person was putting their mouth on you, I'm so done. <laughs> Page of Wands is here. Two of Pentacles is here. I'm so done. So somebody is trying to figure out how can they communicate with you. Yeah, they want to come back towards you. Six of Cups is here. Five of Cups is here. Somebody is definitely in regret. And this person could be sitting back trying to figure out how can they communicate with you. And they have ran around here. In this Knight of Wands energy. In this Knight of Swords energy. In this Five of Wands energy. Wow. <laughs> yeah, Ten of Cups is here. This is a family member that is definitely in regret. Five of Cups for whatever decision that they made. Three of Wands is here. You could have grew up with this person. Yeah, you could have always showed love to this person. Six of Cups is here. As this person is giving someone flowers. Yeah. Knight of Cups is here. But I'm getting whoever this Six of Wands, Six of Cups energy is. This is somebody that wants to connect with you because Knight of Cups popped out. And then the Fool card is here. So this is someone that has romantic feelings for you and this person wants to connect with you and they want to come towards you. They could be in regret for some type of decision that they made in the past as well. The Empress is here. The Chariot is here. Judgment is here. Yeah, you've made a final decision to move forward. And you're on the Chariot and this is why they're coming towards you. Yeah, they want, they want to heal something with you. The star card is here. This person wants to balance something out. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, so they're getting ready to communicate with you. Eight of Wands. Yeah, three of Cups. Because they want to reconcile. After finding out some type of truth. Ace of Swords. And they're, you know, they're ending the cycle out. They could have been in this cycle for a long time. Seven of Pentacles, the world is here. And this was slowing this person down and distracting this person. Nine of Pentacles. Now they want to come back towards you, reconcile with you, reconnect with you after finding out the truth. Wow. King of Pentacles is here. And then King of Cups. This person wants commitment with you and this is someone that's in love with you. They're realizing this. This person could want to speak the truth to you. Excuse me. About how they feel about you. Four of Pentacles is here. And Seven of Cups. Yeah, they could want to... Yeah, somebody was trying to hold on to this person. So they were... They're ending a cycle out of somebody that was trying to control this person with some type of illusion. Like they could have been doing something to keep this person confused, to just, you know, hold, have that person holding back from you and to hold on to that person. As long as they were holding on to um, that person, it was keeping this person in the Seven of Cups energy, like confused. Now that they found out the truth, they're coming towards you. This person is in love with you. They want to heal something with you. And this person wants, this person wants you to trust them. King of Pentacles is here. High Priestess is here. And then Page of Cups is here. Yeah. They want to apologize to you. Because as I said, something came out. The Sun is here. Ace of Swords is here. They found out the truth about something that was hidden. And now they want to apologize. And whoever this, this uh, I often say this cousin. So this could be a distant cousin. A family member that's did that you distance yourself from, 
whoever this cousin is, I'm so done. That person is literally, you know, feeling trapped in front of whoever these people that they were putting their mouth about you in a negative way to. They're in regret, they're ashamed, they're embarrassed because these people see them in this five of ones being envious and jealous of you. Yeah. They're concerned because you're being gifted and you're being seen as an official person and you're being your authentic self. As I said, you didn't even know this was going on behind the scenes, but God was preparing the table for you in the presence of, you know, your hidden enemies. Just so happened to be a distant cousin or a distant family member that you're not even attached to. 